every once in a while, it just so happens that you have the opportunity to do something that is so common, so mundane, and so ordinary that you just can't pass it up. Today, I'm going to do one of those things for you. I have, right here, a box. This box came from Newig. And in this box is my new graphics card. So, I'm going to open this box. Because opening boxes is apparently something that people enjoy doing on the internet, and that for some reason, I don't know why, people enjoy watching it. So here you go. Opening the box. Interesting story. Earlier today, I checked my tracking on this package, and it had said that it was on its way on the truck and coming by FedEx. Well, I checked Facebook, and there was an article put out by the local news station, um, well, technically the paper, the Brattleboro Reformer. We don't have TV down here in southern Vermont. Um, a FedEx truck carrying two trailers full of packages was just obliterated on the interstate right down the road from me. Luckily for me, my package apparently was not on that. This is my package. It's fine. It's a little beat up, but I don't think it went through an epic accident. My packing slip. My address is on there. It's, everyone knows where I live anyway, so it doesn't matter. An offer from the tax experts. Fuck that, I can do that myself. It's just math. And the prize. The prize is... This is my new XFX Radeon RX 480 graphics card. It is the black edition, and it has the hot swappable fans, and there was a special offer that I was able to get a couple of extra fans to go with it, so I got red because my case has lights in it, and most of them are sort of reddish. I don't know if I'll use it or not. So, let's take a look-see. Cutty Cutty Death device over there. I'll need this box because there's a $30 rebate. And there should be a UPC on it somewhere. There we go. That's what I need. Don't let the cat piss on that. This is just a cardboard box. It has a little bit of embossing, XFX. It's pretty bland, not very impressive. I've actually never bought anything from them before, so this is a whole new experience for me. There is a interior box that has doodads and a thingy. Doodads, thingy. And here we have warranty card, and the reason why I got this card over other brands is because with this particular maker, it does not go against their warranty policy to take the stock cooler off and water cool it. Now, will I ever do that? Probably not, but the fact that I can and that they are okay with that makes them a good company for me. I support freedom to do what the fuck you want. Little notice to get the drivers and the magic. Anything 
else hiding in there? Shouldn't be. All right, all good. Man, that's a lot of packaging. I've left that on there? Totally. Is it going to be on there once I put it in the case later tonight? No. Might as well take it off now. I don't know how these work. Well, that's really fucking easy. I didn't have to read the manual or anything. They just have a little pressure clip and they, uh, they clip right in and out. That's Freaking cool. Cool technology. Technology is cool. Let's see near the back plate. It's pretty. You guys know that I like being in the dark, so you'll forgive my lack of good lighting here. I actually made the effort to switch out my 6 watt LED for a 15 watt CFL just for this video for you guys. And anyway, this thing has uh, numbers and uh, a model and it costs um, money. And there you go. Unboxed. I might, uh, well, I probably won't make a video when I put it in the case. There's no point. Um, I'll post some pictures on my Facebook page, though. So if you want to see how it looks in the case, the rest of the system's been built for a while. So uh, it'll just be uh, probably going in later tonight. So those photos will probably be up later tonight. Assuming I can find all the cables I need. Yeah, I don't think those are packed away too much. All right, so there you go. Unboxing video. Hope you enjoyed it. I really don't get the point. Here you go.